How you doing? Okay. Good to see you. Alright, let's just get this start. And then uh, I found uh, these as well. Oh, I was looking for some. I found the bag of them. So. And there, right? there's 10 of them as well, so you can play dirty jokes on people as well. That'd be funny. Good evening. How you doing, Brandy? Let's hope that we get a bunch of people in. Chance, what's up? Hello, Stephen. What's up? Sandy, what's up? Castro, what's up? Uh, you Xy and what's up? I don't even know half of your names. So I'm just going to say hi to all of you. Hi, 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 whoever you are. Hello. So we're going to the burn unit today. We're going to go see a friend of ours. All right. He's had a really rough time as a ghost just recently. So I'm hoping you're all going to join us. And uh, Alicia's with me as well. Say hi. So, um, I guess none of you are going to jump, come and jump in and join us. Let's see who we can invite. Well, we don't want to invite Trevor because he doesn't want to, we don't want him to know that he's here, right? Um, but hello, everybody. It's nice to meet you. Nice to see you all. Jess, what's up? There we go. We'll add them. Uh, 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 uh. There we go. So we'll see who's coming, going to come in and join us. JJ, what's up? Oh, hello. Who have we got in the house today? Have we got anybody good in here at the moment? Sarah Love, what's up? You guys want to come and visit with me and Alicia? We're going to go see a friend of ours. He was in a really bad accident, uh, which ended up making him lose one of his fingers. So uh, that's why we're going to see him today. Uh, it'd be really cool if you could join us for sure if you want to you know i know that something like this is really traumatic for people but you know it's uh hey candy what's up you doing all right we're at the burn unit today we're gonna go see a friend of ours you want to hang out with us say hi to him sarah what's up Shit, i forgot to invite um Paige, didn't I? um so yeah hi how's it going artist touch hello I'm doing, I'm having a good day. We're at the burn unit. We're going to go see Trevor in just a minute. So just waiting for you guys to join in with us so that we can go say hello to him together. Remember Trevor, the one that lost his finger, had a skin graft, put on his feet on the rest of his hands. Hey Houston, how you doing? Juanita, how's it going? You doing all right? So, got a nice little surprise for him. I hope he doesn't join us. So yeah, I know, right? So uh, hi, hey, the App Appalachian Mountains. Are you in the Appalachian Mountains, are you? Blue Ridge Man, it's nice. Yeah. Well, like I said, he's had a bit of a rough go. He's probably going to be doped up as well because he's in a lot of pain. So, yeah, that's what's going to happen. So, if you guys want to come and hang with us, I think he'd love to meet all of you guys. Um, so, he's one of our community members. He's been a member for quite a while and he's got a great sense of humor, but he really needs a bit of love from all of us. So, yeah, that's that. Let me just uh, chuck you there for a second. I'm going to pause for a minute. So just hang on one second, okay? So I wanted to come and visit with him as well. We're going to go live and then we're going to uh, say hello to him. I'm only going to be here for a minute because I've got to go off to Boise shortly. So, uh, yeah, that's that. Uh, you know, how are you guys are doing today anyway, by the way? By the way, this is Alicia. All right, she's one of my moderators. Hello. All right. Welcome to the live. Yeah, welcome to the live. You don't here. So, so, but yeah, so, um, yeah. And that's what we're going to do. So, hello, Miriam. How you doing? Hey, Miriam. If you've got any of the regulars in your um, in your um, followings, can you invite him? Hello, Arlene. How you doing? I'm going to go see, see Trevor shortly. I'm really glad you could make it. But um, if you've got any of our regulars as your friends, hi, dear Ryder. Deal, real deal. Sorry, D real deal. Sorry, I have. I suck. I suck. She is, isn't she? She's absolutely gorgeous. I'm going to get her so. Yeah, okay. I'm actually going to auction her off at the end of this. She points at me as she walks away. So, uh, yeah, so that's what we're going to do. So uh, stick around with us, all right? Because I know that last night, you know, some of you were interested about saying hi to him. Um, Arlene, I know that you um, I know that you sent him a card, so this is extra special for you to actually get to say hi to him. Now, here's something funny. I got him a little gift. Do you want to see what I got him? Hi, how's it going, Sassy Grandma? <coughs> um, so, yeah, so that's what I'm going to give him. 
Did you see that? He's going to think that's freaking hilarious. And plus, it'll go with his sense of humor as well, because what he'll be able to do is play jokes on other people. So um, remember that bet that he had with me? Well, he's going to lose it. So that's definitely the case right there. That's what's going to happen. Did you get, manage to get a mask in there? Yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Sweet. Well, Have they I got just want, wanted to see where it's going. Okay. Do you know where it is? Is it in there? The mask? No, the, the, the button. button. Oh, yeah. We'll okay, go inside cool. and go up to the fourth floor. So, yeah. So, uh, in the bedroom today, nice. So, so I'm gonna play play a joke on him. So he's gonna. Nice to see you. I will have a lovely night, I promise. So I uh, don't want to get into any trouble though. All right? It's kind of a really important thing. This is where we show people how much of friends we are to each other and what we mean to each other, you know. And um, you know, Trevor is a really good guy, and I love him to death. And he's got a great sense of humour. And uh, he's just one of our, you know, regulars that comes in, brings the life and joy into the party. So, um, you know, it's really uh, important for us to uh, support him and to show him that we love him, we care about him, you know. Um, but it's really important. So he's going to be in a bit of a mess. So, uh, so remember that bet that he said he was going to have with me where he could count more fingers, all of his fingers quicker than mine. Well, he can't because I've got his finger here. So, uh, as long as he isn't on here, which I know he isn't because I didn't invite him, so unless he's seen what's going on in the background. In fact, let me just check here, make sure. I so, uh, we got Kaylee, Keely, um, we got uh, Arlene, we got Marian, we got um, Alicia who's here, and we got Miss Brandon Bryden House. So, we're doing good already. We've got nine of us in here. So, uh, yeah, so I'm going to be a bit of a dick with him. But you know what, that's me, isn't it? And that's why I do. I've got a great sense of humour. He's got a great sense of humour, so we can uh, make fun of him. And if he counts him faster than me, then I'm going to give him my hat. My beloved hat that you know I don't want to part with. All right. I'll have to just get another one off Justin later on. But yeah, incredibly Blake. This guy, I'm going to tell you, this guy is like an inspiration to everybody around him. You know? So you're going to get to meet him in a minute, sassy grandma. We're going to get to meet him in a minute. So there's that. This is going to be a lot of fun. Just bear in mind that he's probably going to be messed up on um, painkillers and stuff. So, yeah, the hat. I'm going to give him my hat if he can count his fingers faster than I can. Now, chances are he's not going to be able to because I've got one of his fingers in my pocket. But, you know, he doesn't know that yet. So he's not going to get my hat. Or I might just give it him because, you know, he's been for a lot and it's important for us to look after each other. So, you know me. You know what I'm like. Well, apparently we can go live in the hospital. I'm saving yours, Keely. Don't worry about that. I'm saving your hat. I'm not going to give it to anybody, okay? <laughs> This hat right here, on my head. Look, and bearing in mind my hair's all messed up as well. So I'm gonna have to walk around with messy hair until I get back to my car and get another one. McKinley Magic, how's it going? So, um, yeah, what are you gonna do? You know? We've gotta be there for each other. This is kind of one of the important things about this. This is a pivotal, pivotal moment for us. Not only to show him that we love each other, but him, but you know, to just be there for each other. You know, it's these times like this where we, um, learn to look after each other and we show each other how much we care. So that's that, you know. Um, so we've got Miriam in the house, we've got Arlene in the house. A HC to remember, I don't even know what that means. What's a HC? Is that some kind of weird innuendo that I don't know about? Is that what we're doing now, is it? And, you know, fortunately you went in last night because we had a uh, Phantom McBride in there, we had a D real deal and we had a couple of other people who have been very, very suggestive with me last night. Very suggestive. So but it was funny and you know that I love them all and I love all of you, so Ailey, how's it going? So yeah, so that's kind of what we're doing right now. Um where have we got let's make sure we see what we've got now. Haircut. I do need a haircut, you're right. I need a haircut. No, I'm not getting my hair cut. You can bugger off. Evelyn. I was waiting for you, Evelyn. So, yeah. Thank you for the rose. 
Page, Page McBride, Page and McBride behave yourself. Did I call you McBride again? I keep calling you, don't I? I did, yeah, I did. It was kind of fun. It's it's kind of interesting because it's not something that I'm an alien to. It's being ganged up by a bunch of women. Hello, I, Evelyn. Evelyn, we're about to go and see Trevor. So, hello, Rebecca Miller. How you doing? So um, we're going to have to step into the hospital. Now, here's the thing. I don't know if I'm going to be allowed to go live, but I'm going to go live, and I'll, and I'll shove you in my pocket here until we get in there, all right? So uh, you'll be in my butt pocket, all right? What, what did HC stand for? I don't know. I'm pretty sure we can, though. Hello, Martha, thank you for the follow. Um, so this is a turning point moment for all of us, you know? I would, but I don't know how to invite Michael because I can't remember his bloody username. So if any of you guys know, have anybody on your list that isn't in that group right now, invite them in, okay? Invite them in so that, you know, we've got a bunch of us in here. But what I'm going to do afterwards is I'm going to put this, I'm going to put this live feed on um, uh, Instagram and I'm going to put it on um YouTube as well. Obviously, I can't put it on here because you know you can't have it that live. So yeah, so that's what we're gonna do. All right, you guys ready? Right, so just invite anybody you know. Elizabeth, how's it going? Sunshine lady, what's up? Fran, what's up? Southbound, what's up? So, oh haircut. She's gonna. What did she say? Did she say she was gonna give me a good a haircut? I won't remember. Is that what you said, Keely? You're going to give me a haircut that I won't remember. That I'll remember. Because you, you, nobody touches my hair. All right. I have a thing about haircuts, to be honest with you. The only person that cuts my hair normally is me. Unless I really, really trust you. Yeah. It's a trauma from my past. I'll just say, say that. So Behave yourself, Keely. Don't make me smack your ass when I see you, because I will. And let's let's not get saucy, all right? Because we got um, we got to go see Trevor, all right? <laughs> this ain't about me. This is about Trevor, and it's about you guys hanging out with him, all right? Dirty little buggers, you. What am I gonna do with you? All right, then. Well, I'll tell you what. Let's go in there then. So we have to be over here because we um. Do you know what the funny shit as I go along? <laughs> Helen. Alan. All right, cool. <laughs> I hate hospitals. I don't know how many of you guys like hospitals. You know, I don't think anybody goes, oh man, I love hospitals. I just love hanging out with them. <laughs> I don't know what it is, right? All right, so if I lose any of you guys, make sure that you come back in because this is really important for us to show this. Show them that we love them, we care about them. Well, the floor's down. Dialysis, kidney, blood bank. Um, I give it uh, four. So we're going, up, we're going up in the elevator. It's the first time in my life I've had a bunch of ladies in an elevator with me. And now I'm trying to behave myself, but, you know, it is what it is, right? So, am I glitching on any of you guys? All right. Okay, uh, bone intensive care. A little, all right. Okay, cool. This is really nerve wracking for me because this is the first time we've met each other and also the first time we met Trevor. So, I'll be meeting more of you later on, that's for sure. Burn intensive care. Okay, cool. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm going to make my rounds. I'll meet all of you eventually, I promise. Just uh, right now, it's a. Uh, is, is he an outpatient? Okay, burn intensive care. All right. McBride, behave yourself. All right. I think that's Hi. Hey, 
So we're ready to see Trevor. What's his last name? Christensen. Christensen. Okay, cool. How's he doing today? <laughs> You're an ending yeah, bad. Yeah. <laughs> like he was just—he just decided to cut the rest of his fingers off, right? Uh, 4403. Yeah. Okay, cool. This is really exciting. Hi, Trevor. How you doing, my man? It's good to see you. Yeah. I've got Alicia with me as well. This is, it's Trevor. Yo, what's up? How are y'all? Got some friends with us. Hey, how are you doing, man? I'm doing good, man. So, uh, this is Trevor, everybody. So, say hi to Trevor. Nubs, um, man. We've got, uh, yeah, I know, right? We're going to call him Nubs from now on. Is that what we're going to do? <laughs> so, uh, we've got Sassy Grandma in here, and we've got Arlene, and we've got uh, Paige, and they all wanted to come say hi to That's us. That's awesome. Gonna hold the, you can say hello to them. Tell them how you doing. Hey, guys. How you doing? So in the hospital here. Yeah. Doing better. Just woke up from that. Glad you guys came, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's awesome, man. I just thought we were That's so cool. Yeah. It's good to see you, man. Yeah, you too. So, uh, so this is Trevor. This is his ring. This is where he is. He's and he's got, he's uh kicking it live like his like he usually is. So, all right. So I'm gonna put you down. We're gonna have a quick chat with him. All right. If any of you guys got anything you want to say to him. Let me know, okay? So, uh, actually, before we go any further, me and you have got a bet going on, haven't we? What's the bet that we have going oh, on? Oh, we can count our fingers quickest. Yeah, you can count our fingers the fastest. All right. Um, okay, let me just flip it around. I'm going to flip you around. It'll make it easier for us to do it that way. I am a Batman fan. Here you go. So... <laughs> So you, we've got a bet going on, haven't we? Yeah, we do. So who can count the fingers the fastest? Yeah, we do. All right, you want to count yours first? All right. Uh, well, one. Okay, well, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six. Ah, uh, so you think you count it faster than me? Possibly. Because you might be missing something. What's that? <laughs> Oh, and, so and just and just because you're a little prankster, I brought you a whole bag of them so you can mess with people. That's so cool. Thank you so much. Uh, so uh, oh I can I can think of what else to get you. So I thought I'd do that. That is so perfect. Yeah. <laughs> Are you doing alright? Yeah, yeah, I am. I'm doing good. I'm man. not treating you good. Yeah. Tomorrow's gonna be pretty crazy. I get my sick. I I'll see it. I'll see the thing that for the first time since they amputated. Oh, you get some yeah. staples out and stuff. It's just pretty gnarly, but... So, how, how are you feeling about it all? It's not, not too bad. You're trying, trying to stay positive, you know? We'll see, yeah. but... Trev, you're one of the most positive people I know. Like, you come into our yeah. chats and laugh, and make us laugh, and you've got a lot of fun and stuff like that. So, do you think you won the bet, then? I don't know. I don't know. I think, I think it's my head to take, take on that. Yeah. That's, that's he says, I, I, I took the cake on that. Because here's what I was going to do is if you could keep me, I was going to give you my hat. <laughs> right, but I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Right, this is my beloved hat. All right, but I'm going to give it to you anyway. Whoa. No, I'm going to give it to you. Because, you know what? You're an inspiration to all of us. All right? With everything that I'm doing, you're an inspiration to all of us. Thank Just you. Just your attitude and the way that you're taking all of this stuff. Right? So I'm going to give you that. So and uh, every time you think about that, you can just think about oh, there's a lot of people that love you and stuff. I appreciate that, man. So, yeah. That's awesome. And they're going to let you out of you? I don't know. Probably another week or so. Another week or so. Physical therapy and all that stuff, occupational therapy and I'm, stuff. I'm going to be back here at the end of October, so we'll hang out when you go. Yeah. yeah. That'd be awesome. Try not to lose your fingers. Man. Yeah, for real. So, so we have got backups now. Okay, so do you want to tell everybody about what's happened and... Um, 
Remember, he said he was going to lose three fingers. So you want to tell him yeah, what's Yeah, so uh, I had a butane explosion. I'm not really quite sure how it happened. Uh, gas at that time, apparently, or something. It's a little leak or something. Exploded. Blew up uh, a room. There was a fire knocked me out. The explosion. Luckily, somebody else was there. They came and woke me up. Mm -hmm. Carried me out of the flames. And when I got to this hospital, they told me that there was a 90% chance I was going to lose three fingers. And then the surgeon was amazing and ended up only losing one, my index finger. Mm -hmm. And, yeah, I'm supposed to be here for another week or so to get, and try to get better, you know? So, can, can you guys all hear him? Can you hear what he's saying? Can everybody hear what he's saying? I'll do that another time. And then everybody else will say hi. <laughs> everybody else is saying hi. Um, can you all hear what he's saying? Yep. Yeah, you can hear what he's saying. So here's the thing about Trevor. Not only has he lost his finger, but he's actually got quite a story to tell. So I want you, I want, I want you guys to listen to why. Like you know, you all talk about how inspirational I am to you, but like this guy right here is a walking marvel of a human being. And stuff so i'm gonna get him to tell you i'm gonna take my headphones out i'm gonna let him to talk to you all right so he's gonna shove these in his ear yeah. okay all right i got you on that all right mic check <laughs> all right so let's see let's start at age three i had a brain aneurysm I uh, wasn't supposed to make it out of that, but I did. But that led to what's called a Chiari malformation, which is when your brain grows too quickly for your skull. So I had to have a bunch of brain surgeries then, like five or six surgeries. Um, and that led to uh, about 12 years after that, I had what's called single myelia from a, the trauma from that, which is basically where the fluid from your brain is it has too much trauma, so it fills up by the spinal cord and slowly paralyzes you. And I had a surgery on my spinal cord in 2016. I was in the hospital for probably four or five weeks then as well. And on that, that time I had four or five surgeries because they just couldn't get it right. And it nicked my spinal cord and I went paralyzed for a few weeks. I wasn't supposed to get my legs back and didn't accept that. And learned how to walk again. I think it broke my wrist twice. My nose twice or three times trying to figure that out because I kept falling. But I, I can walk. <laughs> and then, um, yeah, and then after that, I was good until this scenario, you know. And here I am, surviving. I'm not there. Oh, I'm not happy. What can I say? <laughs> walking, walking marginal right here, and he's like an American dream walking. <laughs> like every, so actually, what's your attitude towards life, Josh? My attitude towards life is... It's a beautiful thing to be alive if you're above ground another day, you know? As long as you're above ground, you might as well smile and make the best of it, regardless of what happens, you know? It's a beautiful adventure, don't you think? Eileen said... That's so cool. Are you, are you able to go live? No, I'm not. You can't? How many, no. how many followers you got? I don't know, like 500 or something. I don't okay. know Okay, so what, what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to make a quick shorty Later on, I'll put it on there. Make sure you guys go and follow Trevor. We want to get him live. All right? Dude, yeah, it's so good to meet you, man. Yeah, thank so you. Thank so much, yeah. man. Uh, dude, I had to. Like, you're, you're part of our community, and this is what friends do for each other, right? Yeah, for sure. Um, Come in. Hello. Hey, what's up? Getting ready for Halloween here? Yeah, he's just getting yeah. back in the papers. Yeah, I found his finger just lying in the hallway. I didn't know what was going on with it. So... I don't know. Anything else you need right now? I'm good, thank you very much. Well, listen, man, I've got to go off to Boise, okay? But I'm going to leave Alicia here with you. You guys can hang out for a little while. All right. Okay? But um, when I come back, we're going to hang out, all right? Try not to lose any more of your fingers. Yeah, drive safe, man. Okay, no, we'll do. We'll do. So, all right, guys, have you guys got anything else you want to say to Trevor before I leave? So this, they all wanted to, they've been asking you about you for like days. So it's <laughs> like, um, here we go. Do any of you guys want to come live and just quickly say hello to him before I leave? Uh, it's okay. You're good. Look at this. <laughs> no, it's my 
Yeah, yeah it's his hat now. I, I, I know, I know, I know. He's got an unfair advantage and all that lot, but I had to at least uh, attempt to try and be him. But you know, so don't any of you guys want to come live quickly, or are we good? Yeah, you want to come live, Paige? All right, let me add you on then. All right, invite. Okay, she's buffering up right now. Hey, how you doing? How's it going? I'm good. Uh, Hi, Trevor. So, do you want to, you want to say hi to him? I can hear you. Oh, you can, you can hear from my yeah, hands. So, this is, she's another one of our friends. I actually took her to an appointment earlier on in the week. So, oh, it, just right. feels, it feels like we've done a round of friends at the moment. Hey, you're a lot of friends out here, huh? Yeah, I have. It's apparently, apparently uh, Utah seems to love me. <laughs> Let's tell man managed to find all of you guys. As Dave, well, so. tell Trevor he's an inspiration and we all in here love him so much and we like want to keep in touch with him always. Right. Well, okay, so yeah. Paige just said that you're an inspiration to all of us and that she loves, we, we all love you so much and we want to keep in contact with you. So once we get out of here, yeah, we're going to hang out a bit. So you're going yeah, to sure. come to the Thanksgiving giveaway thing that we're doing, right? Where we're yeah, just going to go to the park and stuff. So a lot of us that are, are in Utah, we're going to actually get to meet each other uh, around Thanksgiving time, which will be a really great time for all of us, you know. We're going to go out and do something exceptional and great and stuff like that. And, uh, yeah, so he's in the burn unit, can't James. Wait meet, can't this wait to meet another you. Guy. This is another guy. She can't, she she can't to meet you. So uh, James is a big um, my car and my bus ride, and he lived really close to me, so I gave him a call and turned up in twenty minutes. Oh, this is really? this is what friends look like to each other, especially people that never. Yeah, and you in you was it forty four oh three or something like that you're in. North medical the, the yeah. 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 So. So all of you guys, I really appreciate you coming and hanging out with us. I know that this is good for Trevor to see the community. So, yeah, the U- university run it, James, that's where we are. Yeah. So. Good then, luck with well, everything, Trevor. Yeah, because we've got to go on to Boise. So if you guys want to, if you, yeah, she said good luck with everything. So I'll be out of it. I'm going to eat and even be here for a little while. All right. So give me a minute. I'm just going to say goodbye to him. Thank all right, yeah. Oh, you get, get yourself to uh, a state where you're out of here, and I'll uh, yeah, sure. we'll hang as soon as you get out of here. Right? Yeah, you um, I'll see you there on as well. Yeah. Know. Know. It's kind of weird, isn't it? Still, um... Great to see him um, in such great spirits after something crazy that's happened to him that's out of his control, you know? So, all right, I've got to get out of here. You guys doing all right? I'm, he- I'm heading to Boise next, so watch out for the videos because they're coming, they'll be coming at you long and fast here real shortly. All right. And you guys, any thoughts? Any questions? Anything like that? We're going down to the ground floor. I will drive safe. I always drive safe, you guys. So it is amazing. And and you know, this is this is something that I wanted you guys to all know about and see and Everyone has a story. Yeah, I mean, like, you heard his story, didn't you? You heard the things that he said. Am I on the right floor? I don't know if I'm on the right floor. <laughs> I could be on the wrong floor. Let's see. Yeah, it looks like I might be on the wrong floor. It looks like I might should be going down one more floor. I don't know where I'm going. It is pretty incredible. 
And it's people like him that give people like us, you know, more. We're going to just go to the A. Is that, does anybody know how to get out of this hospital? <laughs> yeah, he does. We all, all have a purpose, though, Ali. I think that's something that we definitely all need to remember. We all have a purpose. Oh, okay, yeah, we go. Good, we're going the right way. We all have a purpose here. God, I don't like hospitals. I used to work in a hospital years and years ago. Um, you got any idea how I would get out of here? Oh, uh, yeah. You have to go upstairs. Upstairs. So it's on the first floor, is it? Yes. Okay, cool. You know, I'm always losing shit, and I? I can't even find my way out of a hospital. It's amazing how I get around this country safely, isn't it? Yeah, we all have a purpose here, for sure. You know, it's really cool that we found each other as well, so that we can serve our purpose together. So yeah, that's that. How's your days been? But how have your days been, by the way? I mean, let's go up one floor. Let's go to the first floor. How have your days been? What have you guys been up to today? You had a good day today? Rerouting. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, rerouting. Rerouting to the first floor. Let's see. All right, we want to get it. This does not look like it's the way out of here. Lobby. Lobby's this way. All right. I do. I need a GPS out of the hospital, don't I? You, so you've had a good day today, Paige. Good. Walking around with smiles on our faces. Um, there we go. We go. Going the right way. So. I know that you. some of you might have felt that like that was poor taste me giving him some fingers, but you, did you see the look of joy in his face when I gave that to him? Funny, huh? It's cold this morning. Yeah. I haven't got my glasses on. I should have brought my glasses with me. Hilarious. Yeah, it was hilarious, right? What are you going to do? Uh, you had your granddaughter's basketball game. Yeah, I'm watching that. Nice. Cool. Who's playing? Do you know why he is? I did think about that after I gave that to him. I did think that about him afterwards, that, you know, he's going to uh, start pranking all the, um, all the uh, nurses with his fingers and leave them lying around. BYU and Notre Dame. <coughs> Is BYU the t-shirt that I've got with the big Y on it? Now I'm going to upset a lot of people with that t-shirt, aren't I? I did actually see a Utah UU t-shirt. And I was going to buy one just so that I didn't upset and alienate some of the Utarians that are my friends. So, you bloody Utarians, what are we going to do, eh? Let's make sure that my headphones are freeze for a second. So give me one second. Right, let's make sure that my headphones are freeze for a second. So give me one second.
more receptive guys, okay? You guys have a good rest of the day. I'll catch up with you later on.